God for all you've done for me. God is so good. You know, God would be pleased with this service tonight. Amen? Amen? It reminds me of when Jesus was born and the angels in heaven gathered around and were praising God, praising God for the birth of Christ. Now tonight, the anointing has fallen in this place. God has met us here tonight. Amen? Amen? Now, Praise and Power Choir has sung to the glory of God tonight. They look beautiful, don't they? But they have a mess. Their good looks stop them from worshiping in Jesus Christ. And we thank you for letting the Lord work in you and praise God with him. So I know that you have enjoyed them. On last year, I was blessed to work with them. Amen. And Pastor Bird is a wonderful, marvelous for perfection. You know, all things that we do for Christ, we have to do our best. Anything that we do, we must put God first. And you can see the marvelous work that he has done. I hope, have you enjoyed them tonight? And you're just, just waiting for more all right. You want praises for God, but this is a time that Jesus came for us. This is a celebration for us. There's so many things that people go out and celebrate for, but this is what Christians live for every day. God had, came, had come to save us, to save our souls, and make a better life for us to have eternal life. And the choir comes praise and power. I thank you. I thank you. They have done a marvelous job. They have blessed our souls. They have sung praises to God in a mighty way. To God be all the glory. Let's reach over and touch a neighbor on the shoulder and tell them, I thank God that you are in the right place at the right time. So we're going to go just a little bit high. Come on, can we go a little bit higher? Lady, ladies, y'all still got those shoes on or y'all ready to come out those shoes? Look at your neighbor and say, oh, how precious is the name of Jesus. Anybody ever had to call on that day? is the name of